Hey everybody, Custom Mike's here. We are at West Coast Customs Cruise International, and we're going to do a much slower flyover than we did the last time. We'll start with the back. We'll probably come back and forth a couple times so we can see all of the little pieces that are here. But here we go. I know you want some details. We we'll get a little closer in there. There we go. The detail is just exquisite. Yeah, one of the feedbacks I got from Don. Slow down. Based on the feedback that you gave him. And I promise I will. I'll try to do better. I'm learning. Uh, I appreciate the feedback more than you know. There's a replica of a little windshield yeah. action. Yeah. Every day is a school day, right? The kid, that, that, that's the other kid that's with him. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought it was. <laughs> Giving me some trouble with that, with the trouble makers. <laughs> Telling me I missed one. He'll be on the second lap, I promise. Some of these uh, awards are incredible. of awards to many, many different uh, classes, so to say. Yeah, please don't touch the stuff. You know? <laughs> oh, right here. I'm going to do that. I'll pan out. You can stop it and read it if you want. I don't know if it's uh, particular on anything. Okay. 
We try. Because what it is on my wagon, the real one, the back window rolls up into the roof. But there's, there's, there's and then the front piece comes down. That piece of glass is three thousand dollars. I keep the wagon for free. <laughs> so I made sure that all that tracking worked and everything when I got it. What it is, my neighbor had it. And when it said it was in 2020, and when his relatives had to come down to Portland, Oregon, they asked me a favor to get rid of all the cars out there. Yeah. And they said, well, what can we do for you? And so my hand on the fender, and the older brother walking out, walked back out, and here's yours, gave me the pink slip to it. And we had the top of the engine disassembled, because we're going to do a head job on it. And well, that never worked, so I hooked it up to my, my little two yard tractor and pulled it into my yard. So, I'm trying to make a wall of the 71, the 72 wagon. Well, the 71, a lot of it's close enough. Got the same wheel right now. The bump is different. And because it has that, that hot balloon there. What a show. Alright, we're going to sneak in here too. It's okay if I sneak in? Thank you. Got a nice little array of race cars here. Can't complain, man. Living a dream. Woke up this morning. And here I am at West Coast Customs, filming scale models, custom scale models, and race cars. I went to a friend of mine's uh, retirement party. This guy showed up. Everybody thought he passed on. And he looks at us and goes, Fellas, I'd rather be seen than viewed. It's amazing, huh? Very cool. This is Steve Foster that owns the track and owns the Very, very cool. Thank you for bringing it here. Appreciate it. We'll be on the same video.
All right, so that's the model show corner of this building, and it's very popular. Hey, how you doing? How's it going? What a show. The man himself, Don Graham, heading out and handling all this cool stuff. So thank you to everybody that has a good show. Thank you, Don, and all the builders, and everybody that has supported, including the ladies. <laughs> Mexican ladies. Yay, yeah. ladies. <laughs> Appreciate you supporting us yeah, here yeah. at the West Coast Customs Cruise Internationals. And yes, you got this building earlier, but I'll give you a sweep just in case you need a drool factor and you want to go see one of the other videos that we did this room there. We got to say hi to Joji too. How was the drive? Good. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> hi everybody. Santa Maria 2024. You know it. Thank you for being here. Very family special. Anyway, love y'all. See ya.